for the whole wide world of NIMS. Oh, In the Lord, baby! Oh, my God! How you doing, everybody? Yeah. Yeah. That's my cheat sheet. Check TV. This looks terrible. Like I have a magazine my face on. I look like the most conceited fuckwad in the world. It was just a gift. It was just given to me. Hey, look, this is Hillary from KXLU. That is the coolest radio station. <laughs> Actually, I'm, I'm the booker here. He's I'm the booker. booker of the Redwood. And man, he books some damn good shit, Bob. How do you know like what to book? In my gut, I know what's good and I know what people will, will like. But about new stuff, how do you find bands that nobody ever finds that the Redwood has? I've seen so many things here for the first time that... Well, uh, I kind of feel like I'm young at heart because well, I, you know... Uh, All the chicks bands, flock to him. Young Ooh. band... All the girls have problems. They want to talk to Bob. Young bands play here. Bob and, wants to something out of their problems. Yeah, well, I'm a problem solver. That's there you go. If you skill. know what he means. But yeah, young bands play here all the time, and and we've had a number of them that have just, like, blown up. I know. Gone that's what I was saying. Signed, How do you know? The, he goes, these bands, no one's ever heard of them. He finds I, them, and they blow up. Same way I did it when I was with Flipside. It's just, you know. Same the way you did it for the Nymphs. Like, when you put us on the cover and we yeah. blew up. I mean, Bob has a hell of a lot to do with my success. He knows uh, it. I yeah, know it. You know. Seriously. Uh, yeah. You know, I'm not, I'm not afraid to stick my neck out, which I think is the only thing that differentiates me That's from true. a lot of people. That, people uh, are you know. pussies. You don't care. If you love it and you feel it in your gut, you go for it. Yeah. I'm the same way. If something's in my gut, I yeah, don't care what anybody says. For instance, here's a perfect example. Mm -hmm. This is kind of embarrassing, but um, what's his name? Harry Styles. <laughs> the new Harry Styles song is so good. That one that sounds like a 70s ballad. Yeah. And I was so embarrassed, like, to tell my, oh my God, I like a song. What was the, his horrible band? It was the worst. Oh, uh, ma, 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 uh, In one of those boy bands, but it's the worst yeah. one. Do you know? Which is it? it one but, Direction, exactly. Uh, yeah. And his music is nothing like One Direction. And all the One Direction kids, like the nine-year-olds, are like, I don't like this. This is a terrible song. This is a sad song. But if you love something, you don't care what anybody says. Yeah. Like, I just admitted that. Yeah. Now, would anybody think that Ingrid yeah. Laurie from the Nymphs would like that? No. Yeah. And I'm embarrassed that I said that, too. Fuck, it's on tape, and I fucking, oh, man. Now I'm really screwed. My image is wrecked. Well. Bob, how did you, why did you do this to me? <laughs> well, <laughs> I might not be the smartest guy in the world, but at least I sleep at night. It's like. <laughs> and you, he doesn't sleep alone, ladies. <laughs> What have you been up to lately? Rocking, recording, I've got a really great new band. Uh, the oldest kid is 23. They're like half my age. Like, they could be my kids, but they're awesome, and it's a whole new experience for me. They actually respect me, and they're nice to me. Unlike the real nymphs who used to get jealous that I got attention. Hey, isn't that what a front person is supposed to fucking do? There you go. <laughs>